So it's Sylvester, the QB kid, and the Jaeger boy. Sup? How's everyone doing? <laughs> Derek, you growl is great, QB. Can you do that again? Growl! That was, that was a little different. But I like it. What kind do you want? Welcome to this heavy metal episode of OK Gamers. We last left off, we killed the big thing. And it's little friend. <laughs> Even though... That's the best I can explain it. The little friend was the one that controlled it. <laughs> it's not an ego thing. <laughs> the League of S. Wait, it's a bunch of small people? Yeah, like just small size... It's small sized. Uh, it's like Final a, a Fantasy. Clan? It's Final Fantasy, so small size anti imperial people group. That sounds great. Like every Final Fantasy. The does League this. of S has got to be the worst name for the Resistance faction in a Final Fantasy game ever. That's kind and of what I'm thinking. And, and I'll remind you that in Final Fantasy 2, they were in fact called the Resistance. Yep. <laughs> Brigade! Like, the, our bros are just called the Brigade. <laughs> Which is important to note in, as a part of United States history that in one of the main best seasons of Big Brother, the, <laughs> the main <laughs> faction of people that teamed together was also called the Brigade. And they fist bumped every chance they could. They were d adorable. And oh so straight. What season was this? Season eight, I want to say. Oh, it should help you on your way. Never saw it. The Brigade. Well, no the Brigade. So you want to know it's a real trip? What? Big. Okay, we got on the topic of Big Brother. I'm sorry, I should not have started this. No, I know me too well. Have. Yeah. Big Brother. The one of the weirdest things in Big Brother that was surreal to me was going onto YouTube and seeing that these Big Brother contestants have YouTube channels. That's weird. That, that are like based on their personalities. Hey, look at this guy. Oh, we got the Earth Hammer Man! Yeah! Yay! He's just so happy that he can now fix his helmet. Oh. We'll accept it. That well, one guy's got a fish like... on his head. Holy shit, that's a nice report. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Best helm in the realm. Oh, I get it. Helm, realm? It rhymes. Helm in a selm. <laughs> <laughs> they should wear hel helmets in a helm cell match. Yay! <laughs> Alright, we're leaving Final Fantasy 1. Yep. That's how it works, I'm assuming. Well, we're leaving the beginning of Final Fantasy 1. Also, you know what this means in World of Final Fantasy? In order to go to a new Final Fantasy game world, you take a train. Which means the train goes into every Final Fantasy world. Including that's how seven. you know. That's how you know every Final Fantasy game is a JRPG. It wouldn't be one if it wasn't if there was no train. The trains connect them all. Does Final Fantasy fifteen have a train? Yes. Yes. Near the end. Oh, that's right near the end. Yep. Mm -hmm. It's really. It's actually like a really important part of the end game. Yep. And it kind of makes like a really appropriate metaphor for what's happening because like the game constricts so hard. Looks like yep. we're gonna have to find a way through. Oh shit, I just thought of that. That's actually really brilliant. It's like literally putting you on rails. Yeah. It's it's almost like the game is separated into parts of like Duh! She says the same line if you pause in the middle of it. Pause. Ah! Oh. <laughs> That's torturous. <laughs> anyway. No! Wait, she just keeps saying it. No, no, the fucking way. Oh, well, thank you. Ruin me. Take a piss on the lawn and smoke more weed. <laughs> God, Jaeger boy. We're in the middle. You're an inspirational trash monster to all of us. <laughs> What's the middle of your recording? You're actually leaving to take a piss? I'm You're gonna take a piss break in the middle of the the show. The middle of the show. You're taking a piss break. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Wow. What is this carnival bullshit that we're running here? That's okay, gamers. <laughs> Moo. 
Oh, you're gonna catch it. We're gonna catch a oh. moo. Oh no, we're not catching a moo. We need to catch guess. it quick. We we'll name it before it. Jaeger Boy gets back and ruins the name again. Oh, uh, I hope so. Beautiful. We got it. We got it. I love her dagger. It looks like a ritual dagger. Like she's having blood sacrifices <laughs> with this dagger. It kind of does. Oh. oh, let's name it. This Mirage's name is going to be Tony the Tiger. I don't know if Tony the Tiger can fit. Whoops. Tanya. Uh. Where is... Here we go. Oh. Here's how you fix this. Tony the T. What? Tony D. Tiger. So it's not even going to fit that. Tony, then D. Oh, you gotta make the D big. Don't worry, this will work, I promise you. Tony, okay. capital D. I, I believe in you, I'm believing in you, alright. Perfect. Perfect. All right, Tony D. Tiger. Now we need somebody named Ty Dillinger. There's not even, that's not even a tiger. A Nothing not. about that's a tiger. No. It's some weird squirrel monster. That's why I was very confused as to why that was the name you wanted to give it. Hey, look, Phoenix Town. We're gonna probably want to go back, by the way. There's okay. something I want to show you. Okay, we have to go back. <laughs> we have to go back to the island. We have to go back. God damn. Kids, if you weren't around for Lost. <laughs> God, I bet all, your whole family was into Lost, huh? Well, first of all, you didn't miss much. I'm so sorry people had to be into Lost. And I just started this episode talking about Big Brother. <laughs> it's not a fair world out there. No, nah, and one of those is a lot better than the other. Whoops. That was murder. It was yeah, murder. I mean, at least Mike Mizanin was on the real world. That's, uh... Not really Big Brother at all, but, uh, yeah. I'm just saying. People think, of, you know, reality TV is bad. But it's got The Miz. The Miz is on reality TV? He used to be. That's how he got to wrestling. Really? Because he created a wrestling persona on his fucking... On the real world. Yeah, on oh. the real the world. The original, the first run of the real world had Mike Mizanin and Mizowski. And then he was in, and then he was in WWE Million Dollar Tough Enough. Oh, nice. I didn't know that. He's the only guy to ever really become a big star out of the Tough Enough competition. He was tough enough. He was, in fact, tough enough. Wait, Which what? It's astounding, considering we're talking about Mike Mizanin. He was... Oh my god, you know what? You know what that makes The Miz? Because The Miz won Tough Enough and became a huge star? What? That makes him the, uh... Oh, what's her name that won American Idol the first year? Kelly Clarkson. Kelly Clarkson. He's the Kelly Clarkson of wrestling. Because out of all of the American Idols... Was she like country or something? Kelly Clarkson was one of the... Was pretty much the only one who made it. Yeah. That's true. There were a couple others. Uh, Ruben Stutter is still pretty successful to this day, actually. Kelly Ray Jepsen was Jeez. third place in Canadian Idol. Right, there you go. Really? Yeah, and that's how she got her start. Oh. Because Carly Rae Jepsen is a star. And she got yeah. robbed. <laughs> Welcome to the metal episode, where Carly Rae Jepsen was robbed. Also, what? we're Kingdom Hearts now. What? Yeah. What? Oh, fucking righteous. Oh, pause, I gotta fucking... This is whole. This is straight up Kingdom Hearts now. Jaeger boy's like, I gotta smoke two or three weeds real quick. <laughs> Can we not enter Kingdom Hearts yet? But I need the weeds. Who are you? It is and still I'm the 420. My name is. Huh? It was right there on the tip of my tongue. Oh, don't worry. No, we got you. We got you. Uh, we can see it on the screen. Your name's girl who forgot her name. Yeah. Fuck. That's her name. Don't make the joke at me. <laughs> <laughs> Bastard video game. Will you join me for tea? Uh, well, you might say that we're sort of passing through. But I'm Lon, and this is... It's Rain. And my brother and I are from Ninewood Hills. Lon it's pretty nice. Rain from Ninewood Hills. <gasps> of course. I had a dream about this. I saw the two of you come here. Today's the day. 
Oh. So she is that one of those Kingdom Hearts symbols on her back and front? Yes. It's Kingdom Hearts everywhere. Okay. Well, I just didn't know if that's like a Kingdom Hearts thing. The things in her hair, that's Kingdom Hearts too. Okay. All right. Can we call her Guffin? Yeah, let's call her Guffin. This Girl who forgot her name. Heart. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you smoke two weeds, you sit down on the couch and say, This isn't a Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> no, this is Guffin. Yeah. Yeah, good boy. Welcome back from smoking the weeds. Here's a Guffin. This is Lon, this is Rain, and they're talking to Guffin. Whose soul will you touch today? Well, seeing there's only three people in this room, and we don't want to touch you, we're just going to touch each other. <laughs> <laughs> but we're brother and sister. Oh, gosh. This got weird. Yeah. Oh, gosh. Guffin, why did you put this... We need to get out of this room. No, we got to do something. First. Oh, we got, we're literally going to we're gonna do an intervention, huh? We have to intervene, yeah. Uh, we got interviewed. Wait, is a Bridges Woes? Why is a Bridges Woes a five star? Quest? Because it's really difficult. Oh, yeah, cool. Yeah. Also, so, I didn't know if you knew this, but um, Nakamura is basically the Roman Reigns of New Japan Pro Wrestling. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. In, he didn't start getting over aside. until he made up a gimmick after way after they'd started pushing him way too hard. Huh. I know that. I must be more tired than I thought. Far too much excitement all at once. Did you know that Roman Reigns is the Roman Reigns of WWE? Yeah. Yeah. I'm far too aware of that. Yeah. It's, it's news to me. Saw that on Wikipedia the other day. <laughs> Top line. After all, she likes spending time with her subjects. You were mistaken. <laughs> Double dunked. That was a little bit of the FF1 battle theme. Yep. So basically, what happens is that, uh... Holy shit! We go into their battles and fight with them, but they see everything as if they're doing it. Oh my god, that's themselves. weird. It, it's very weird. Intervention, that's so cool! I still don't have the best grasp of how any of this works. So you can just at any time like choose to like do some extra battles that are story related to other side characters? Yep. That's really cute. Yeah. And you get stuff for doing it too. This is very Disgaea. Hey bus, you buds, you want to do a extra battle for funsies? We'll tell you a secret. Ooh. <laughs> if you secret. do it, we'll tell you a secret. <laughs> Foxy Fire. Oh. I think you got these guys. I mean, you've done this fight before. I mean, they're stronger now. Oh, wait, you mean on my own? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, no. We're good. Yep. Ooh, good hit. Oof, I don't like good hits, though. That's bad. I mean, oh, no! Sorry, I shouldn't congratulate the baddies. Yeah. Please. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Jeez. Um, let's see how much damage it actually does. Just plain. Oh, I don't get. Dang. Oh, lucky me. Very lucky miss. Oh boy. Um, You're living on the edge here. Now I can stack back up. With one MP. Yep. Gear him. Three MP. Yeah. Doop, doop, doop. Do I wanna maybe just Not kill right him? Now. Just kill yeah. this last ad. Nice. Yeah, there we go. Now we shall kill her. Oh yeah, no, you've got this. Just yeah, clean up this last guy. Yep. They had a bit of a numbers game on you, but you really you overpowered.
overpowered them. You overcame, and that was yeah. good. Yeah. I'm starting to really get the flow of this battle. It feels really nice. It, it's it's a good it's a good battle. And very simple. Yeah. Since there's only three things moving on the screen right now. Uh yeah. You could just take it slow. Just heal whoever he attacks and. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Attack with the other one. Numbers game. Although if he critical hits again like that, your stack's gonna fall over again. Yeah, I, I don't want that to happen. That'd be bad. Should probably start hitting harder. Oh, well, you know some of the magics. You don't say. I'm just waiting for my AP to go up a little ah. bit further. Ah, yeah. Because my AP goes up every single uh. Woo! Turn. Ty goes to the runner. Does Ty, does Ty always go to us? Um, I don't know. Maybe. That, on the screen, that looked like a legitimate Ty. And we went first. Yeah, maybe. That's maybe cool. it goes to us. Ooh. That's, uh, that's a lot. <laughs> a little more than uh, what I like to see. He has, a, he has a good amount of armor, so... So what's going to happen when this guy's dead? Do, is there going to be a little final cutscene? Do we get to see, like, you'll see, you'll Sarah see. come in and be like, Oh, my warrior of light, dude, what are you doing in here? And she's, like, pushing some bodies underneath the carpet. Oh, nothing! <laughs> and then they have a hot makeout scene. Why yes. does it smell like murder in here? Oh, could be anything. I just murdered in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I did not need to hear that. Just night stuff. Dude, Slap. drop dead. Drop dead. <laughs> hey, drop forever. dead. Just fucking die already. God, he's so close. There we go. Oh, good. Woo. Sweet freedom. Took him long enough. Good fight. Thanks. Good fight. Good night. Thanks. Um, I prefer Legend of Dragoon boss battles where you know the battle is over when a cutscene plays of a guy running up and attacking. Yeah. The cutscene, like, plays out right there. I'm glad that her highness is absent. The last thing I want is for her to be abducted again. <laughs> for the third time. <laughs> but has she ever been taken before? Wait, is this a thing? While battling that Federation soldier. Though some divine force was oh wait, we saw her get kidnapped again. This warrior of light hasn't before. No, he's talking about uh, Final Fantasy One. Oh, because the first mission in the game is to uh, save her from Garland. That's rad. That was cute. What yeah. When we do that, what does the other person experience? Even time Warm sensations all over their body. This place is power. I mean, basically. That will be. Oh damn! Did a little of that transfer onto them, and that's why she was like, "I don't want her getting kidnapped." Or he was, the knight was like, "I don't want her getting kidnapped again." Yep. Damn. Yep. So, this was the most Kingdom Hearts episode. Holy shit, that's cool. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. There's just some like meta mechanics in there, like some meta universe. That's ruled. <laughs> and we get to keep all the prismariums we find. There's like no downsides at all. Seems that way. Yeah, is there other downsides? This is like some metabolic time chamber stuff. Meta, wait, meta hyperbolic time chamber. As opposed to a metabolic time chamber that's just really good at digesting foods. She read your thoughts, <laughs> idiot. I'm not a god. I'm like more than that. I'm like, what's above a god? What like a super god? Gods are kind of like known for all creation, right? But we're not really creating anything. We're kind of above creation itself.
I'm basically the universe. Like everything when you, that the when you universe are is. when you are any and all existence, creation is kind of a joke. <laughs> when it creates some, oh, already did, and am continuing to, and will be doing as always. God, what's above God? I don't have a, I don't even have a word for Gwiffin. She's a, she's just a Gwiffin. Yeah, that's it. Well, next time. Next episode, let's get out of this room, because this room's too much. It's a lot. It's, it's a hyperbolic time chamber, like, bat computer room. <laughs> you know, like, in the Dark Knight, or in the Batman Rises, when what's-his-name turns on the god computer? Yeah. And he's like, we're doing the thing, Batman. And he, Batman's like, sick. <laughs> I love That's the voice awesome. I love the voices that you give for Alfred and Batman. I'm gonna look just like every computer and phone everywhere. Nice! Bad call. You're really cute. Good butlering. Mm, good job, Alfred. This is awesome. Everything Next time we're gonna get out of this awesome. room, so I'll see you tomorrow. I'm Sully Sylvester. Are you gonna do it with me? Oh. Sully Sylvester, the QB kid, and the Jaeger boy.